how does it feel to be in the top 10 again? <laughs> Well, you know, that rolls around every now and then. It's not the first time, but, you know, you, you see these uh, these ratings out there, and, that, you know, they're always fun, and I always scan them and see. And, and uh, just the fact that, uh, you know, we, we make that kind of uh, a ranking every now and then is... Uh, uh, what a testimony to the people of our city. Yeah, and it's not just the first time that you've been, you've seen this yeah. best place to live in America designation. Live. Why do you think... Westfield consistently lands in that with with that designation. Well, you know, I, I think it's that we've we've had a uh, a, a great uh, city to work with. Uh, we've had a good supportive uh, uh, council in the past, especially where we can we can work together to to make a quality place. I mean, not only things. But uh, what I call the, the heart of the city, our youth assistance program and all of the service agencies that we have around here, it's the friendliness, the safe, and the quality of the schools. You put all that together and suddenly you rank out of thousands of cities all across America. That ranking wasn't just Indiana. That was in the top 10 in the country, Chris. So when you have companies that want to establish themselves elsewhere, that they want to maybe open up a, a headquarters uh, in Indiana. How much do you think they look at those rankings? Oh, I think that uh, many of the companies that have located here over the last 10 years, they've noticed that. I mean, it's it's a marketing tool that, uh, frankly, it doesn't cost us anything. We've invested in our city. We've invested in our people. We've invested in our schools. We haven't invested much in marketing. That's the best marketing we could possibly have. And if you think about reasons why people want to live in a particular city, why do you think, what are the combination of elements that you think are very attractive for Westfield? It's Grand Park, it's Grand Junction, it's the friendliness that we've been able to capture. You know, I like to think Hoosiers are naturally that way. Uh, and I find from people moving other places, I mean, from things as simple as, uh, you know, a lady says, hey, we just moved here from uh, California. And you know what? My neighbors brought my trash cans in last week. I've never seen such a thing. I mean, all the way back to uh, just last week, uh, I, you know, I met a guy on the street and he's uh, uh, at the grocery store. He reminded me, Chris, that uh, uh, we'd met because our youth assistance program had recognized his two kids at our youth assistance breakfast because shortly after they moved here, uh, they lost their mother and he lost his wife. And we recognized his children because they, they survived it. And he turned to me as he left. He said, uh, he didn't thank me for Grand Park. He didn't thank me for our trails. He said, Mayor, thank you for what your city has done for my children. So all of those elements that you've worked, you've, you've worked to achieve for Westfield over all your terms in office, where do you want to see Westfield go? If, if, if there was one or maybe two or three pieces of that puzzle that you still would like to see filled, what might they be? Well, I, th I think we need to uh, expand our, our, our corporate base. I think we need more quality uh, corporations here, large or small. Uh, medium size is kind of our market. Uh, they have not had a problem, those that have come here, attracting uh, people, employees, because they're able now, because of our growing reputation across the country, and not only the rankings, but of Grand Park and such, you know, people from far away say, oh, Westfield, isn't that where that sports park is? That's been a huge marketing piece too. So when you put all of that together, uh, it makes a very marketable situation. So we're kind of suspecting we'll see ourselves in this position again. Well, we certainly hope so, Chris. And you know, you asked me, you know, what else would I like to see? I, I would like to see us continue down this path such that we endeavor to create a, an environment here that is just as desirable in 30 years as it is today. Mayor, thank you. See you next week. Okay.